Dear students, uh, this is our last module on Dreamweaver, and in this module, we are going to uh, practice all of the things which we have learned, and we will start inserting images on which we uh, finish the last module, and we will also practice that whatever we have learned until now, how we can make uh, use of all of those things to make a really uh, attractive web page that have uh, some information for others. So let's start the practical. So first of all, I have the same uh, uh, document and let's say my final page as a title. And then for example, I'm interested to make something as tourist places in Pakistan. So I want to make a page on for it. So I selected it and you can see it's over here. And then I can say that this should be heading one and it would be shown like this, lively like this. And I can also add bold to it. All right. And then I can also uh, go into format. And here is uh, different styles which are available, which I can use. And I can also use the color. So for example, if I want to say that this should be the color for tags which are like strong one for example so you can see that it would be shown like this so anything i will make as strong will have this color from now and let's go again back to the system and uh, after this I need to add a table so let's say I want to add a table which has four rows and uh, maybe six rows and one column and it should comprise of a large wide row like this one so you can see that it has appeared and now I can uh, create some space over here and here I can uh, write whatever I want and you know where I need to write I need to write over here this is uh, this page tells us the beautiful available in Pakistan so this type of thing I want to write right so this has appeared like this and then I can add here an image for example maybe here insert image and first of the image is maybe from Faisal Mosque. So I will name it as Faisal. And I will see how it looks. It looks quite a big image. So maybe we can try to make it a little bit smaller. So in the design you can see and then for example here you can add the next one in the split so you can write over here in this column this is very interesting building in Pakistan
and you can see that it has appeared like this and then I can add an image over here yeah over here insert image and this is the monument of Pakistan and I will give a name So you can see that this monument has appeared but it has long width and height so maybe I need to make it uh, 700 by 500 to just show you yes it is being shown over here so this page is being developed and I can also select this text and in HTML I can try to make it bold and you have seen that as soon as I have made it bold the same style which I have applied on it has been applied on it right so such kind of formatting and style you can you can uh, use from here so let's add another image insert image and this is Batshahi Masjid right and let's see how it looks like so it is again having large width so maybe we can reduce it to 650 by 500 all right so this page would look like this and when we save all it has been saved as somewhere here my fourth page so if I click on it so you can see that it is showing the title uh, over here my final page and then uh, the heading having tourist places in Pakistan and then I have written some information with the picture then another information with the picture and then another uh, another image and I can add some other information with it so you can uh, practice such things at home uh, by collecting different type of images from uh, internet uh, that belongs to different tourist places in Pakistan and you can also copy the information related to those images and you can make such an in interface and then you can also uh, you can also say like this for example at the end uh, here in the split code if you are here so you can say developed by your name right so it will end like this so it will show like this and let's save and then let's go into the same location and try to see the page again and you can see that at the end it's showing that developed by your name so this is very powerful tool the dream weaver which has many many functionalities but as we are in the first semester so we do not make you burdened of many many different things which are possible to be designed in uh, web development so you uh, might be learning some of the courses related to web development uh, and there you will also learn some programming to uh, add some buttons which uh, will work and when you click on those buttons so 
it would uh, give you some meanings as you normally use uh, those buttons in normal web pages so you would be able to uh, make um, um, enough progress in this area when you will uh, study those courses but until now you have a starting uh, uh, place that you can at least build your own home page uh, with your own picture uh, with your own details so I think you should try to build your own uh, web page explaining uh, what you are how you are and what are your plans so all of such things can be um, added to uh, such uh, web page of yours and then at the end you can write your name so dear students let's conclude today's module we have learned that how you can uh, practice all of the things which we have learned using Dreamweaver and we have made um, uh, a practical example real world example where we have made a web page and that web page was explaining the tourist places in Pakistan and I have discussed that you should try to design your own home page explaining your own uh, ideology and your picture on that particular web page.